Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to the second part of my video series and in this video we are going to create a PDF file and then we will uh, convert the bitmap image to the uh, PDF. Okay, so let's get started. So in my previous video we just uh, got the uh, image from the image gallery and we set the image to the image view. So now the, in this video we will continue our uh, app so let's get started all right guys so what we can do here is first of all we can say pdf document pdf document okay equals to new pdf document okay and then we can set first of all pdf document dot page info pi we can say equals to new pdf document dot page info dot builder and in here first of all we can say bitmap dot get width and bitmap dot get height okay third argument will be the page number okay so how many how many pages you want in your pdf file so we can say only one okay because we just want to display an image okay and we here we can say dot create all right and so what first of all now the next step is we need to create the page so we can see pdf document dot page page equals to and here we can say pdf document dot start page and in here we can provide pi all right so now another thing which we need is the canvas to draw i mean okay so what we can do we can say canvas canvas equals to page dot get canvas okay and also we need paint object equals to new paint we can set the color i mean so we can say pan dot set color so we need white color so what we can do we can say color dot parse color and here we can say hash triple f triple f okay and finally we can say canvas dot draw paint okay and we can pass paint here all right guys so the next step what uh, what's the next step is we need to uh, i mean scale the bitmap okay so how can we do we can say bitmap equals to bitmap dot create scaled bitmap so first of all we need a source bitmap so we have the bitmap okay so we need the destination with the destination height okay so what we can do we can say bitmap dot get width bitmap dot get height and if we need the filter we can say true all right and as we had the paint so we can say and dot set color and we can set the color Oh, I mean which color black or blue okay blue okay and the next step is we need we can draw the, the, the bitmap so we can say canvas dot draw bitmap and here we can pass our source bitmap okay and we can pass zero float left float top and it will be null all right and finally we can say pdf document dot finish page and here we can pass page here okay so guys this was the step in only seven to eight lines of code it's very simple first of all we created the pdf document object okay then we created the page information okay we needed the information like we what we want to display on the page so first of all we 
got the width and height and okay and we created the page and then here we started the page okay start page pdf document dot start page it means we have to link that page to our pdf document okay object and finally we uh, draw the uh, we draw it okay the bitmap to the pdf file and finally we finish the page okay so now we need to save the uh, save the file save the bitmap image okay so how can we finish uh, do that so first of all we can uh, let's first of all go to android manifest and here add some user permission so first of all we can say user permission write external storage okay and also we need read external storage all right so here what we can do we can say file root equals to new file and here we can provide environment dot get external storage directory and here we can say we have uh, the folder name so we can say pdf folder okay and then we can create we can check if root dot exist if the root does not exist so what we can do we can say root dot and make directory all right fine and then we can say file file equals to new file and here we can say root and the our file name so we can say i mean picture pdf dot pdf all right okay let me remove the the pdf here okay and finally we can say pdf document dot write to and here okay so first of all we can generate i mean create the file output stream equals to new file output stream and in here we can provide the file as we're saying uh, file not found exception so we can have as io exception file not found exception all right so we can cut that and paste it in our try block okay let's remove that and here we can say file output stream okay so we can say pdf document or write to and we can say file output stream all right so and finally we can close our pdf document object all right guys so this was the code i hope you have learned so let's run our application so first of all let me open site sync all right guys so now our, uh, i have connected my phone so let's run the app and let's see if it works or not so we have the folder name pdf folder 12 let's see if it works or not okay so guys our application is running so uh, let me click on pick image
okay so we did not uh, write the method here so we can say on click pick image so let's run our app again All right, guys. So now, if I click on pick image, so from there I can uh, select the image. So wh what image I can say? So I click on here, and here you guys can see I have the image and the PDF file is now created. So let's check if we have the PDF file. Go to your files, okay? And here open internal storage, and here check your folder one two. Here you guys can see PDF folder one two. Click here, and here you guys can see picture dot PDF. Okay, so we click on open. We open it always, and here you guys can see I have the image. All right. So guys, if you like the video, please like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye. And in my pre uh, in my next video, I will show you how to display the PDF in your Android application, okay, using PDF View Library. So, watch my next video and goodbye.